Hi friends, I am here at my house, um, both of my houses, in Branson, Missouri, taking care of the guest books. I decided that it was time to update them. Um, this is my old one, and as you can see, it's gotten pretty worn. Um, there's some dirt and things along here, and then inside, see how it's come apart as well. I was also not happy with how flimsy the pages are. What I did do was I laminated the pages, so they're nice and laminated, and then I put them into the scrapbook um, page holders so that people could turn, could have two pages, um, two page spread. Uh, this has lasted maybe, I don't know, three years or so. So it's lasted quite a while. Um, information in it needs to be updated though. And as I said, it's gotten dirty in here too. So I decided to update both my books do something again similar. I'm not a big fan of the big three ring binder type of thing. So instead I do scrapbooks. And these are the eight by eight size. And I got them just at the Michael store. And I like to get the ones with the windows so I can put something in them. This time, um, see I was going to do a printed um, like that other one, but I ran out of time. Um, I have so many ideas and then all of a sudden it's time to go to my place, which is a three and a half hour drive and I didn't plan too well. So I didn't get the, the inserts printed that I liked. So at Michael's, I looked for a little sticker or I was going to write it with um, a pen. It was gonna write welcome, but then I found this sticker that said hello. And I really liked how friendly that was. So each of my books has a hello sticker. And then this time I did a little bit differently. I also did the laminated pages, but instead of putting them into the inserts, these are the actual laminated pages. And I had the printer laminate them with an extra margin over on this side so that I can stick them into the little, um, little things here. So if you look at it, see it's got a little bit extra margin. She didn't put as much margin as I had requested, which is kind of a bummer because I wanted them to stick out a little bit more. I wanted the whole printed page to be on this side instead of inside a little bit. But it's okay. It'll it'll work out. It'll be just fine. So here is uh, my front page. It's just my little welcome letter. It also reminds them what is inside here. Get a hold of us, best grocery store, favorite restaurants. And then a reminder as well that I also use the HomeAway app for my welcome information. And this is the same information inside the HomeAway app as in the guest book. So they can look at this while they're here if they want to sit down and look through a book but it's a reminder that they also have the information on their smartphones when they're out and about. And then of course I put my phone number and email, always my contact information everywhere. So I'll just show you on um, what I also added was I have a social media page and you can see uh, just a little reminder gently to remember to tag us and check in. We're both on Facebook and Instagram and then the hashtags we'd like them to use. The other thing I added from before um, that I did not have before is these little um, dividers. And what I did is I took images from my listing, images of my house, and then used the app Canva, C-A-N-V-A, to add the words. So that turned out really nice. Um, the printer didn't put the holes in as neatly as I would have liked, so this page is a little off. But I will live, it's, even if it's not perfect. So emergency information, then helpful tips. I have helpful tips on how to use the door lock, um, reminder how to make sure it's locked, and then also that if they don't lock up when they leave, there is a $40 charge. And then as well as my information if they want me to check to make sure they got it locked. Then parking information, which is important around here. Uh, next, the, you know, the big thing is they're gonna look for the Wi-Fi and what to do if the router um, is not working, TV, cable, other helpful tips, refrigerator, heat, AC, trash, toilet paper. One thing I do, especially those of you with larger homes, is just a reminder with the refrigerator that it does take up to 12 hours to cool items, especially when people are going in and out on if you got a same day turnover. So I always put that information in there because a lot of times people think the refrigerator is broken when it's not, it just needs more time to cool things off. Then a few more things, you know, paper towels, light bulbs, laundry, grilling, coffee maker, and the Keurig. Then of course the sofa sleepers, very important information for my place and checkout time. Next section, a neighborhood amenities. Again, I used one of my photos that I had taken. 
The only thing I don't like about this is it's not able to lay flat. So as you can see, it's a little difficult for me with just you know one hand showing it to everybody. So the pool, fitness room, basketball court, playground, hiking trail information, explore. You know, you don't have to use professional photos either. Um, if you're really good with your smartphone, this is one of my smartphone photos on one of the hiking trails of when we were here last month. So that's my son there on top of the cliff. And um, I added the word explore. So just all kinds of information such as buying show tickets, which is important in Branson, as well as traffic and Silver Dollar City and the best way to get there. And then golf courses, it'll have all kinds of hiking trails. And I'll just quickly flip through here so you can see the rest. Let's see, my other hand's holding the smartphone, so it's a little, little difficult. So we got more trails. I ended up with like three pages of trails. So then groceries. Again, one of my listing photos that I took. Um, I have two main grocery stores for this area. And then this is another cell phone picture that I took um, at a re breakfast at a restaurant. And I just give, you know, there's so many restaurants in the area. So I just give one or two per type of food for my guests. We even have a farm to table restaurant and I list that in there. Address, phone number, and then last but not least, I got a little thank you picture of me and my boys and our dog Lucy from Christmas and my thank you letter asking them uh, to please leave, do leave a review if they can't leave five stars to please let me know why so I can make sure everything is good for the next guest and um, also to let other people know. And again, my contact information and my website. So that's it. That is my new guest book. I am sure everyone has, um, you know, ideas that they can do, but this is just one idea what I like to do and thought you guys might enjoy that. Uh, if you want more helpful tips, tyannmarsink.com, T-Y-A-N-N-M-A-R-C-I-N-K.com is my website. I'm a commercial photographer for vacation rentals. Um, I'm also an industry professional and I speak at events, summits, conferences, as well as teach at the VR Mastered Bootcamp. That's vrmastered.com. And I give away all of my workflow and all of my insider tips. Um, I have a newsletter. Be sure to sign up, tyannmarsink.com slash newsletter. Check me out on social media, Instagram, Facebook. I'm all over the place. We'll see you later. Enjoy. 